Today we'll be using the light tetradulies, the tetradulies kit with a decent special, certainly better than the first kit. I've used this weapon quite often, and of course I've also used the first kit too, so I know somewhat how to use them, but it's been like well over a year since I've actually put any time into them, so I'm not going to be playing very well with them today. You get a sprinkler with your sub weapon, which is not great. You can use it as a meat shield occasionally, and it can help you paint further away as long as it's not being shot down, but other than that, it doesn't really have too many uses. When this weapon was first shown off, a lot of people had high hopes for it since it did have a good zip caster special, but in the long run, the regular kit kind of worked better, as having a good sub weapon is very important, and while the special of Reef Slaughter isn't particularly great, it can be used occasionally, and since the weapon's feeding anyway, it's not really too terrible if you die after it. Either way, you know the drill. We'll go for three wins, and if we get three in a row without any losses, we'll go for a fourth win. I'll see you in the first match. All right, match number one. We're starting in Clams, which isn't too terrible of a mode. It's not like spot zones where the weapon has poor paint output. Right off the bat, we're going into the fray. This is a skirmisher weapon. Uh, you can shoot while you're dodge rolling, which is pretty nice, but your dodge rolls don't really travel too far and have terribly long um, end lag on them. I think right off the bat, we're going to just go ahead and gather some clams and get some map control down. This weapon is not necessarily a damage dealer. It's more just trying to stay alive while your teammates deal the damage. Um, I don't really want to put those clams in, I don't think. That's just going to end pretty badly. So we're going to back up, let our teammate help us out with the kill there. Very nice. But I do see where I'm at since I am marked. I believe, yes, their blaster is marking everyone. Try to help out in that fight over there. Did not keep trap or keep tabs on that curling bomb there, and it did sneak up behind us and kill us. All right, there's a stamp. We're gonna maybe take care of it. I don't know why I peeked out from behind cover. I would have been perfectly fine, I think. I'm not quite sure if the bottom hitbox on the stamp actually goes there. All right, just try to keep this guy at range. We did get hit by the screen, but I think we'll be fine. Uh, did get a wipe out, so good on our team. Gonna go ahead and just throw some more paint down. Again, the weapon isn't the best at painting, but it. It's a shooter top, so it can throw down something. I'm going to go ahead and try to farm for, um, if I can aim correctly, our Zipcaster. Maybe get some distracting going on. Keep throwing some paint down. Unfortunately, get killed by the blaster. I am not really getting in very quickly today. Teammates get another wipeout. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, well, I mean, I'm not going to complain about getting carried. It's just not going to help me improve at all with this thing. I think right now, we just want to try to... Uh, be a nuisance and be a bee in their base All right now. I'm just gonna let our teammates jump to us Throw our sprinkler down and just watch the map honestly All right, we got this guy over here can help out with some jump shots If you do want to open a fight with jump shots go ahead Again, this is a weapon where you're not necessarily going for a kill You're just trying to distract and let your teammates get the kill Got someone over there. They might try for a jump. They are Alright, they're going to get that in, but that's fine. We have plenty of lead here. I think I'm going to go ahead and just run in and try to distract. I do have some clans on me. I don't want to lose them. Keep this guy at range. I'm going to use the terrain to my advantage so he can't just kind of shoot vertical shots at me. Got a bunch of stuff going on over there. Oh, here's the blaster. I heard a shot go off, but I had no idea where he was at or if he was that close. Alright, we'll jump back in here. Again, I'm just kind of floundering around quite a bit. Did get that. Unfortunately, didn't grab these clams in time, but that's fine. Don't really know what's going on here. Okay, I've got my rolls refreshed. I've got to try to keep this guy at bay. All right, good. Got our zip caster. Maybe can take this guy out at the very least stall, so I don't just immediately die. We actually take two out with our zip caster. Zip caster is much more consistent at killing since it got a buff a very long time ago, actually. So it actually feels pretty decent to snipe people with. Just gonna kind of throw our sprinkler up there. Maybe it'll be a meat shield. Maybe not. We're gonna shoot at some people, maybe, because we didn't have clams either, and we'll take our first win. All right, match number two. Looking like we have some AoE. <laughs> Lots of AoE, actually, to fight, and the Stamper is even somewhat AoE since it has burst bombs. This weapon struggles with that, so we're gonna try to maybe shark and get some kills like that. There we go. Good kill there. Friend actually took the shot for us. I appreciate that very much. Gonna shoot under there, maybe get some fall off on someone trying to climb up, and really need to manage our incorrect over here. Keep shooting at the roller, and our friend actually takes him out. I really don't have the range to actually poke that guy yet. I believe there's someone over here. Okay. No, I'm probably dead here. 
Alright, we're gonna recover as much as we can. He didn't have any of the damage on him. <laughs> oh no. Alright, we're gonna jump back in. He's got a clam, so we need to watch him. But we do have tabs on him, so that's good. Don't want to be... Maybe I can get him... Oh, I hit some fall-off shots on him at the very least. Good. Just gonna try to hide around in my ink. Make sure I'm not a sitting duck here. Uh, again, save your dodge rolls. Don't just use them immediately because you have long, long, long in lag on them. Come on, get the kill. Oh, lag. <laughs> oh, that's not good. Stamper's on the right here. They've got someone else running up here. He did not expect that, but <laughs> lag is being weird today. Definitely would have still got that off if I hadn't have killed him or if, if I had killed him a little earlier. That's just how lag is. It actually happened on their screen. So can't really, you know, complain too much. That's just how the game works. Gonna wait up here, maybe. Ooh, wait a second. This looks really good, actually. Just run away. <laughs> maybe we get something in there. Uh, the dynamo just appeared at that moment. I'm, I, you're seeing how I, I'm not really too comfortable with this weapon, and I'm making a lot of weird plays um rushing in a lot and doing things that this weapon really shouldn't be doing you're, you're skirmishing you know and i can tell you that all day long but i've got to try to do it myself a little bit all right roller all right he's got some damage on him but that is a range blaster attacking me I'm gonna try to just shoot at this guy suppress him make sure he can't feel comfortable moving our friend actually took him out back this guy up he will have to back up for sure They're actually setting a bubble up there very interesting all right, maybe get a kill. Uh, we get a kill on someone at the very least. Lots of trades this match too, which is fairly interesting the way they're happening. Oh, he waited too long. Um, <laughs> I guess I should probably mention that too. The spread mode RNG on this weapon is also horrendous. I want to say it's the worst in the game. It might not be exactly that, but... Your fire rate is certainly not fast enough for how bad this is. You really want to only want to open with them. That way you can just immediately dodge roll into something. Okay, that's fine. I'll take that. You know what? If I'm just going to keep trading, that's why I have quick respawn. Just so I can maybe get something going. Um, he's going to be lined straight to our goal. Thankfully, our friend did kill him. Getting a couple more points in from our friends, which is very nice. Um, maybe just going to shark out here. If they try to go for my Hydra friend, then I'm going to be right here to stop them. Hold on. Good. Get tag team, though. I didn't realize I was, he was right there. Oh, we're down to one. Hold on. Hold on. I can do this. Nice. Okay. There's our second win. Clams is definitely being generous today. All right. Match number three. We'll see how this one goes. Not really too terrible on the AoE front. So we should possibly be fine before we die to the... um. One thing, need to be careful of the Nautilus. It is very scary because it can delete you pretty quickly. Those are very high velocity shots. <clears throat> like I said, like I said there, he's just almost deleted us. Just gonna try to maybe mix up this Nautilus here and maybe we can all just tag team him. He's gonna back up, which uh, I'll take that, honestly. As long as we're all still alive, that's good. Out of ink, so gonna back up. Maybe just spread some paint around and play painter for a little bit. I'm probably going to be the best painter in the match on our team. Um, certainly not on their team. They have a sploosh and a, uh, what's it called? H3. Aha, I see this guy. Hold on. That didn't quite work out. Oh, he's got it. Don't let him do it. Ah, and he said had a stamp too. <laughs> All right, we've got these two over here. Hopefully I can get a teammate to come in and maybe help. Stop this guy out. Maybe our friend, okay, a friend will sacrifice himself. All right, very good, very good. Jump shot RNG being very nice there. Up uh, wouldn't probably hurt to have some intensive eye on this, but I don't have any intensive eye on quick respawn gear, so that's not really gonna happen. All right, so this isn't going too particularly great. We're gonna try to stop the sploosh this way. Okay, good, he didn't really try to kill me there, so uh, I survived that somehow. All right, there's a roller over this way. You can actually just paint his area. Our friend actually takes the kill on him, and I'll go ahead and just start painting again. Bit of a slow match here. Um, anytime we overextend even a little bit, the Nautilus just kind of clips us with some damage, so we need to be careful. Oh, no. Back up, back up. 
Don't want to get hit by a vertical flick either. We actually get something in, which is good. Just try to distract the um, one feller, and maybe he won't kill us. Good. Almost out of the missiles, though. That's not particularly great. Oh, nice swipe out. Unfortunately, I am in zip ca zipcaster mode right now. Maybe can get the kill on that. I don't think it kills two armor, and I don't even know why I tried. I would have landed back <laughs> in mid and been perfectly fine to throw some clams in. So that is me throwing right there, unfortunately. Not intentionally, but still not particularly great. Gonna try to maybe just guard my friend here and be an annoyance. And we're gonna not dodge roll here and just try to duck in and out so we can uh, disengage if we need to. Losing a lot of stuff over here, they're gonna see me, so if they take the bait and maybe run towards me, that's fine. That puts them in a worse position. They're not really doing that, though, because there's not really much or many people near me. He's gonna probably try to chuck that, so we need to stay in a good direction. We actually got some chip damage on him, so I'll be happy with that. And just gonna try to, you know, stay where we're flexible and not at a point where we're just gonna die. All right. Oh man, that didn't work out quite as well as I want. This guy has pretty good aim, and most Nautilus players seem to. It, it just, it's just a very good weapon that, you know, really rewards your aim. Especially if it's charged. So, that's why you want to, you know, starve any Nautiluses of paint. That way they can't move around as easily. Oh, careful. Yeah, just gonna back away from this guy. Maybe let our longer ranged friend poke him. And then I'll... Oh, try to sneak around. Didn't really work out very well. Still taking some damage. I'll try to shoot at him from undercover. Remove some of his paint. He's gonna have to back up at the very least. I'm still taking some damage. So just skirmishing here. Maybe landing our teammates... Get some points in. I will take that, honestly. In fact, I don't even have clams, so... Maybe get the kill on him. There oh, what? Nope, that didn't kill. That killed, thank thankfully. Alright, still don't have any clams. I'll be able to get one here, though. Alright, we'll extend that timer a little bit more, and our friends will take another KO. I am being hard carried this time. All right, match number four, uh, E-Leader. A little scary because it can clip us whenever we are in our end lag. So we'll try to do what we did last time and not stay in our end lag too much. Uh, Blaster's going to be a little scary too, and we can back away from the Dapple, so we should be fine. That being said, we are just kind of being tag teamed. Okay, well, uh, that's not a great start. And they've already broken our barrier too, so this might... Be a bit rough, but we'll see what we can do. If someone's lurking around here, I'll just go ahead and paint over them. Try and clip the um, dapples there. Come on. Okay, I'll take that. He's got chip damage. Our teammates should be able to finish him off if they see him. I'm going to signal the ouch there, and maybe they will take care of him. Good job, Brella. I'll give him a booyah for that. Uh, they're clamoring for a clam, so I'm going to go ahead and grab one. All right, good. Good. Just get that one in. Why not? Why not? I probably could have got the kill on the duelies there. They did have a bit of damage, or a little bit of damage at the very least, but oh well. We need to just make sure they can't retake us quickly, and for that we need to stay alive. Would like to charge Zipcaster to take out this leader, so I'm going to go ahead and throw a sprinkler out and maybe just maybe get our Zipcaster pretty decently. All right, that's fine. I'm going to honestly shark. Just wait. All right, leader has Kraken, so now we know where it's at. And maybe just try to take aggro from him. All right, we're going to try and get the leader, or at least someone. Come on, there we go, that's good. That's good at the very least. Uh, okay, and leader is so far back that we can actually just safely move in. Not really sure where leader is at, so I'm just going to kind of shark. They... I guess he saw me. <laughs> that would make sense if he saw my ripples because he moved very quickly there on me. All right, back in here. Leader is shooting, so we need to be careful. Tag team that guy. He overextended way too much. Good deal, maybe. Okay, good. Saved our friend there, too. I'm going to paint over here so our vacuum can maybe move. He's getting ready for a sneak shot. That's good. We actually saved the clam, too. Still don't really know where the leader is at, so wait, hold on. Okay, <laughs> five shots there. Oh, yeah, no. Should have went in for the roll kill because I, you saw there, I hit a bunch of shots, but they're all split between targets. Our friend is doing an amazing job of stopping 
So hopefully I can get in and protect them. Can't really let the leader take the clam now, can we? Just throw a sprinkler out, get some paint, maybe for our zip caster, which I got once, I got once. So that's decent at the very least. But I'm playing very scared around this leader. Okay, careful. Uh, nice. Finished up the kill for my friend. Gonna poke forward a little bit and just try to clean up some clams. In fact, I'm gonna just make a clam here and... Just maybe. Uh, we don't really have a back line I can give this to, so we're gonna have hold to it. The leader is also shooting at us, so I'm gonna do this. Hold on. Nice. Oh, no, that didn't kill. That didn't kill, but that did, so that's good. And just, yeah, staying back here, playing it safe, letting our teammates clean up forward a little bit. They still see me, so there's not really... The only reason I'm just kind of sharking here is to maybe get someone to bait. Oh, no. No, you don't. No, you don't. I have more range than you. All right. <laughs> just keep paying. I do see someone over this way. Got some damage on him. Getting assist. Very nice. And just hold defense here, honestly. If our teammates get in, that's great. Um... All right, you know what? Don't really know where the leader went, but that's fine. We'll go ahead and take a trade. We'll drop the clam over there. And honestly, never have really thought about it, but sacrificing yourself to get a clam closer, you know, it didn't really work out here, but in something like voice comms, which I've never done before, um, might honestly be a decent game plan. Of course, pushing in regularly and having a good team to, you know, coordinate and stuff like that. I'm not saying your team's bad. Don't don't take that that way. Our team is hard carrying us and we would have no hope without them because uh, we are playing pretty horribly here. I'm like playing anchor <laughs> this entire time. All right, kill him. You don't get that off. And our friend actually breaks their barrier and there's four wins in a row. Um, I did not expect that at all. But I guess we were blessed this time, and I'm very thankful for that. So, yeah. All right, well, there's four wins with the Light Tetradilies. Uh, that went, like, a hundred times better than I expected, because I had not been doing very well this week. So, again, don't think this was anything I did, because I was very hard carried here. Um, Clams is usually the mode I do the best in. But again, I didn't do very much today. I just tried to stay alive and maybe shoot people that ran at me. Either way, I uh, hope you enjoyed. If you did, please consider leaving a comment below and maybe even consider subscribing. Until next time, bye.